Hello guys, this is Reese from Bomberito St. Peter's Volkswagen in St. Louis. Today I'm bringing you a 2021 Volkswagen Atlas SEL Premium. This particular one is deep black pearl effect on the exterior and it has Shetland and quartzite uh, leather interior. It features LED headlights, LED running lights, LED all weather lights, 20 inch alloy wheels, LED tail lights, chrome exhaust tips. There's a look at the new Volkswagen logo on the back and the Atlas name badge on the back as well as a tow hitch, 5,000 pound tow hitch down below there. We'll take a look at that so you can see the setup there. You will still need the seven pin adapter added. It doesn't come with that standard. LED tail lights. There's a look at the side marker lights. These are IQ lights. This car just came off the truck. I am not running the engine on this one because it's going to run out of gas. As they come off the truck, they're purposely out of gas so they don't get stolen. And they're also in limp mode, but this one's actually been taken out of limp mode. It's been PDI'd, but it hasn't been gassed yet. So I'm not going to even risk running it through the car wash either. Uh, chrome accents at the base of the door. Black plastic cladding below that chrome line. Chrome roof rails, chrome uh, window surrounds. Park pilot sensors, park assist, the new front end with their aggressive chin on the bottom there, air intakes on the side. Panoramic sunroof with the power sunshade, easy kick open hatch, larger uh, reflector strip on the base of the bumper there. Let's take a look inside. And by the way, this is keyless entry on all four doors. Here's a look at that quartzite and Shetland beige interior. Uh, the quartzite is this gray strip right here. Now that's only going to be on the front two seats, as you see right there. Also, it has three seat memory right here. Lumbar support here, forward and back, and then seat back here. There's a look at your power door locks. It also has Fender audio. One touch up, one touch down for all the windows. Power folding mirrors as well. They fold in just like that. Power lift gate as well. So I lift up on this guy right here. I can open that and then lift up and hold and I can close that. As we look back over here, here's your automatic headlights. Also, all weather lights just pull out on that guy right there and that opens up the or turns on the all weather lights you have a coin box for storage down here now while we're doing this video pay attention to where the colors line up uh, you do have the Shetland in color color or light gray interior color for the headliner uh, you do have dark gray up here on top of the dash you have Shetland beige down here on all of the plastics here and also in the door panels with the premium stitching here you have Shetland Wood grain interior right here. It goes across the dash and over into the door over there. And then on the floor, it's black carpet. So places where your feet are gonna be and where scuffs are gonna be are typically colored black. Um, so you don't have to deal with those. I wanna turn the engine on because it's about 92. You can see that right there, it's 92 degrees. So we're gonna run that for a second and then we're gonna shut it off. Volkswagen's digital cockpit right here and also Volkswagen's new logo right here. The steering wheel is a flat bottom leather wrapped steering wheel. Little bit of piano black right here, mostly silver now. The mapping of the buttons is all the same right here. Steering wheel, heated steering wheel is up here now. That has now changed. And then you have your instrument cluster here where you can change between dial screen, wide screen, and crop screen here. You also have nav over here. I can move it over to here. And now you can see with the crop screen, the dial screen, and the wide screen right here. Your gear is right here. Speed is right here. Fuel gauge is right here. And temperature gauge is right here. There's a look at the uh, flat dash there, storage tray right here. AM, FM, satellite radio. You also have trajectory steering and I apologize for the high fan speed but it's super super hot in here I want to turn that down a little bit 
uh, you do have that it turns according to which way you turn the wheel the red line signifies your bumper the green line signifies if you're going straight back the yellow line signifies when you're moving the little five you see there is for the dynamic road sign display it's also up here you now have that on the cars on the uh, SEL premiums uh, and then also you're gonna have a heated steering wheel heated seats and ventilated seats so there's your ventilated seats there's your heated seats you can run them simultaneously uh, also you have a, a tri-zone uh, climate control so you have the rear and the front too so you can adjust fan speed here you can also adjust fan speed for the rear also you have air care air care is your air filtration system that blue line is going to signify the uh, cleansing that it's doing it's basically filtering the air uh, so there's no pollutants in the air uh, also you do have the auto start stop switch right there that stayed the same it used to be the heated steering wheel was right here down here you do still have two USBs an auxiliary port and a 12 volt charger port wireless charging right here it will charge with your phone in the case face up right there in most cases push button start right here electronic parking brake you just pull up on that guy right there to take it off you push down with your foot on the brake also you have your climate control I'm sorry your uh, uh, four motion controls here so your driving modes you have snow and you have your normal conditions and then you also have off-road custom which you can tweak adaptive cruise control all of these little features right here So I'm going to shut this back off again, and then I'm going to just turn on the ignition. Okay, so cup holder is lit, so you have that in an SEL Premium. Here's the key fob that you have. It has your start, I'm sorry, your remote start right here, your lock, unlock, and trunk release right there. On the side is your panic button. Here's a look at the leather seats. They're heavily perforated. They're ventilated seats. They're also heated. In the glove box over here, there's a look at that CD player, SD card reader number one and number two. One's going to be for the navigation, the other's going to be free for vi uh, video or music. Then you have four extra holder spots right there for SD cards. So let's take a look at the back seats, or the middle seats here. This is a captain's chair option. This one comes in at 50710 The extras on this are going to be the captain chairs themselves, and that's it. Let's take a look at the back seat, or the middle row. There's a look at your captain's chairs there. They're also that Vienna leather. They're heavily perforated, just like the ones up front. These seats are also heated. That seat over there is heated. This seat is heated here. If you were to get a bench in this, the middle section seat would not be heated. However, the two outboard seats, that one over there and this one, would be heated. Latch hookups right here for each seat, both sides. Adjustable armrest right there with a dial where you can lock it in and adjust. Climate control right here and that can be locked out up front you do also have a giant panoramic sunroof so I'm going to show you that I'm trying to rush through this in a hot car power sunshade right there and there's a look at that panoramic sunroof so we shut this door here pop-up windscreen right there there is your giant panoramic sunroof and that sunshade goes all the way back to here there's a look through Instrument cluster, center console, armrest right here. Storage in here is also going to include another USB right there. These seats do not have the quartzite gray color. They're just going to be the Shetland color. And you have a sunshade on each side for your passengers in the back. So what's nice about these seats, I'll show you over here, is if you have a car seat, rear-facing car seat, they have a hookup here for each side so you can do two rear facing car seats here uh, but when they when they graduate to a front facing booster here's where this car really shines still hook in right here this little lever right here allows you to tilt this seat forward the bottom drops out the seat pushes forward you don't have to remove a car seat to get down to get into the third row same with that seat over there these both do it unlike chevy traverse chevy traverse you can only exit on one side from the back row this one here, both seats do it independent of each other, and you're able to exit from both sides of the vehicle. Those headrests do flick up with the flick of a wrist. Notice how high off the floor the uh, seat is. 
So you're gonna have extra comfort there. This is a six passenger version. So there's a sculpted headliner there. So you can get a six, four person back there and they're still gonna be comfortable. Let's take a look at the back. So look at that wheel right there. In the back hatch here, this one has nothing extra. Uh, it's just uh, a base SEL premium, if there is such a thing. So there's a look at that giant panoramic sunroof, the center console, a look at the seats all the way through. There's a vent on the floor right there for your rear passengers, also vents on the C-pillar for each side. These two seats in the back are gonna be leatherette seats. They're not gonna be leather. The four up front are leather. The two in the back are leatherette for durability reasons. Fold that seat down, fold that seat down. Now you've got cargo space. The captain's chairs will fold down as well. They're carpeted black on the back for a reason. So you don't actually scuff them up or mess them up when you're carrying cargo. While carrying cargo, you can also clip your seat belts out of the way. So you have that on both sides. Front license plate, we'll put that on on request. You have a trunk light on each side. 12 volt charger right here as well multiple cup holders in the car underneath the floor here there is your subwoofer it's a quick release subwoofer with a spare tire underneath jack apparatus is over here and if you need to pull these seats back up there's velcro on the strap here you just pull on the strap and you just affix the seat just like that and just like that and now the seats are back up make sure that this little cylinder is not showing red and that way you know it's locked from safety standpoint these are still reinforced on the back so in the event of a rear impact none of the cargo back here goes flying into the backs of people up front those seats are also reinforced there well as well here's a push button look at the easy close hatch it says SEL v6 on the back very nice looking car this car comes with a four-year, 50,000-mile bumper-to-bumper warranty from Volkswagen. It's four years, 50,000 miles. Two years of free maintenance are also included in that. No additional charge. If this video or any of my other videos have helped you, please make sure you ask for me when you come in at a dealership or call on the phone. If you do buy from me at Bomberito St. Peter's here in St. Louis, we're going to give you a 10-year, 200,000-mile nationwide engine and powertrain warranty, free of charge. That's nationwide, so it doesn't matter where you live. You fly in and buy a car from us, you're going to get that 10-year, 200,000-mile nationwide engine and powertrain warranty, free of charge. Also, if you buy from us at Bomberito St. Peter's here in St. Louis, you're going to get a third year of free maintenance included. So your 10, 20, and 30,000-mile oil change is going to be covered. That third one, though, is a free one at our dealership. Other dealerships won't honor that, so if you're out of town, um, your local dealership will not honor that one. So that one will have to be done here So it gives you a reason to come see the arch uh, the st. Louis Aquarium see the st. Louis Cardinals or the new MLS soccer team once they start up So if you're interested in this car or any other, please give me a call 636-290-4257 636-290-4257. I'm on Instagram YouTube and Facebook at resells cars. Thanks a lot guys. Have a great day